Hello and welcome. My name is Lucas Miller. I am the singing zoologist. I teach kids about animals and the life sciences through music and stories and multimedia programs. My life cycles program is intended for the younger kids at your school, so pre-K or K up through about second or third grade. We'll start with a story and a song about the migration of monarch butterflies down to Mexico. Three, two, one. Now watch those wings. They start off small and then they get bigger. The whole thing wraps up with a song about the migration of monarch butterflies called Going Down to Mexico. And, but I began a metamorphosis. Yeah, I wrapped myself inside my chrysalis. I grew and I changed inside. I turned into a monarch butterfly before it gets cold. It starts to snow, 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 snow. I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go down to Mexico. All right, here we go. Well, I'm gonna fly, fly, fly. Fly, fly, fly. I also work into this story of the monarch a song called Metamorphosis about the changes that a tadpole goes through as it becomes an adult frog. I got gills on my neck. I got no legs yet. But just to wait and you will see a metamorphosis, meta metamorphosis. I'm gonna be more than this. Wait and see. All right, help me sing it now. After the monarch song, we're gonna look at the life cycle of a plant with a song about the Texas blue bonnet that'll get your kids laughing and singing. Blue bonnet time. He doesn't look so happy, does he? Blue bonnet is blue bonnet. Blue bonnet time. I think they stayed a little too long out there. You sit a long time, you get a sore behind. Take a closer look at a blossom blue and bold. Mm -hmm. When there's a white spot, fresh pollen they've got, it turns purple when the pollen is getting old. There's usually time for one more song, which could be a rap song about bees. Oh, we were buzzing by the dozen, then we wouldn't if it wasn't all for the good of the hive. It's all about the hive. It's all about the hive. Or perhaps a song about the fruit bat and the way they help mango trees carry their seeds from place to place. Can you see the connection to the bat to the tree and the tree to you. The tree gives the fruit bat food. The bat helps the tree and the tree helps you. My Life Cycles program is offered both live and asynchronous. Live is good if you want to make sure the kids get an opportunity to ask questions. It also allows me to see them better and respond to how they're reacting to my show. The asynchronous option allows me to edit things a little more tightly, and it also heads off and prevents any technical issues whatsoever. So I hope to bring my program to your school. Thanks for watching.